Isn't water very cheap these days? Yeah, I know. It's because the lakes are filling up and there's a huge amount of rain every day. Do you want some water, by the way? No, thank you. Is water really supposed to be that expensive? Is there any solution to it? Let's find out. As you can see, in the back of me, this was once a huge lake. But today it has dried up. Why? There are three simple reasons to this. One, we depend too much on lakes for fresh water. And secondly, we don't recycle water over here in India. And thirdly, we depend too much on cyclonic rains also. Cyclonic rains are rains that come to Chennai in the end of every year, during October and November, for the retreating monsoon. But this year, we didn't get any rains. So, the effect. Is this the end? Are all lakes in India going to dry up, as you can see behind me, a dry riverbed? Is India going to go into a famine, unable to feed its 1.33 billion people? Are we going to run out of water? This is an urban area in India where the untreated sewage from buildings gets dumped into the sea. Of is there any way to recycle this water? Yes, we can. With this water recycling plant. This water recycling plant consists of three chambers. Chamber 1 is for coagulation and flocculation. Over here, positive ions are added to the untreated sewage and the heavier particles settle down. After this, sedimentation happens and the water moves to chamber 2 for filtration. There are three layers in this filtration process. One is gravel and the second one is sand and third one is charcoal. After passing through all this, it removes all the dust particles and removes most of the bacteria and parasites. After this, it moves on to chamber 3. Chamber 3 is fitted with a solar panel. This solar panel gives it energy to heat it up and let it boil for about 1 hour. After boiling for 1 hour, it kills off all the bacteria in the water, making it suitable enough for drinking. You may ask what makes this project unique. Well, here's the answer to that. The main thing is it's cheap. On an average, a rainwater housing system costs about $8,000 to $10,000, but this would cost only about half of it, about $4,000 to $5,000. And the second thing is we can fit this up on any household building, making it easy to install. Earth is made up of three layers, the hydrosphere, the lithosphere and the atmosphere. Out of these three layers, the hydrosphere plays the major role, as this is a layer that contains water, which is very important for all living organisms to survive. Water is not only important for humans, but also every other living organism on this planet. If we don't start recycling water now, this is what will happen to Earth, which is nothing but a dried up barren land. We must start recycling water now to avoid any such kind of situations. Thank you for watching our video.